want to learn how to change it to this. Keep watching, I will show you. <laughs> Welcome to Aiden's Painting Hacks. Today, I'm going to show you something, specifically, how to create a V-groove joint on a wooden window frame. As you can see, this is a Maranti frame that has been put together. The white frame is an old frame, and it doesn't have these joints. I think it looks nice when it all flows together, so today I'm going to show you how I do it. What do you need for this? You need a putty knife, some coarse sandpaper, and a scraper. What we're going to do is, we're going to put the putty knife at a 45 degree angle on it. You're going to run the putty knife along the frame, keeping it slightly angled. Then, you're going to put the scraper in it. And you're going to do this three times, so that you get that joint in there. It doesn't have to be too deep. Then, you're going to take some coarser sandpaper. I have here P80. You're going to put that over your putty knife, and you're going to sand that edge. In principle, you're done now, but I'll sand it a bit further because I think it looks better that way. This is what you're going to get as a result. I'm going to clean the frame a bit, and then I'll show you the final result. As you can see, it's become a very nice V-groove. And you can make it yourself now. And if you compare it to a Maranti frame, you can hardly see the difference. This is the window on the inside. And as you can see, there's hardly any difference between the two grooves. You can hardly see it, and when you're going to paint it later, it will hardly stand out, but you will have a nice looking frame. Do you want to see more handy tips? Give me a thumb up and subscribe to my channel so you won't miss anything. In the video next to this, you will see another useful tip so that you can learn even more things. Also watch that and apply it during your project. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Adios.